I see it's quite simplistic in nature. I'm glad you, you've realised that now. Just a hint of sarcasm from Danny there. While he adds the oat biscuits onto his infused rhubarb, Noel's laying chocolate on more chocolate with strawberries, strawberry coolie, the uncurled chocolate twirls and lastly biscuits. Or is it the last thing? Just a simple dessert getting even more simplistic. Yes. For a final theatrical flourish, Noel's using dry ice stage effects. It's simpler the more I look at this. Blue gloves. And Noel's still not satisfied. Can I change this, this one here? This chocolate look is all falling down. While Danny adds the last touches to his dish, Noel really has finished. Oh, except for a spritz of strawberry essence. Well, that was definitely simple. Yeah, it was. Going for the full dramatic effect. Definitely not retro, this. this is, I think so. This and is I think, modern. I just think that's... Sexy? Yeah, I think it's... it's, it's um, simple dessert. It is a simple dessert. <laughs> Noel looks quietly pleased. But it's time for the two chefs to taste in private and say what they really think. With gloves to protect himself from the dry ice, Danny is trying Noel's first. This looks good. It looks complex, complicated, doesn't look inviting, looks hard to eat. Because of the structure of it, it's going to fall to bits. So, despite Noel's Herculean efforts, Danny doesn't like the way it looks. It's chocolate mousse with strawberries and a little chocolate hard centre with biscuits. I don't know what the Melba part, where it comes from. Well, Noel can answer that one out in the kitchen. The whole purpose of the oven as a Melba is the smoothness of the, the strawberry, strawberry sauce, and certainly the whole sweetness of the actual dish itself. So what does his rival make of all those flavours and textures? It's just too rich. You just you don't eat two mouthfuls and you're like, whoa, stand back. So it's too full on for Danny. But is it the perfect pudding for its creator? The, the size of the portion is a bit too big. Okay. So cut down on the portion size, chalk it and do it a different way. He's going to make it even more complicated. But is it right for the banquet? 50 waiters bringing that through into the gherkin would look definitely a little bit funny. You would have to laugh a wee bit at it, you know. And I think with the blue gloves against the <laughs> white ear, it would look, would look quite funny. But understand, it's theatre and food sometimes is theatre. So at least Danny can see its dramatic potential. People could say it's a bit over the top, but it is. I think food sometimes should be a bit theatrical. You know, sometimes service is a bit like the opera. But the fat lady isn't singing yet. It's Noel's turn to taste Danny's dessert of poached rhubarb with crispy porridge, hot milk and ice cream. Rhubarb's lovely. Very nice. Certainly the biscuits are quite and chewy, but there's a lot of liquid with it. Sweet, sour and the rhubarb. So it's OK, but not very special. What does Danny think? I thought the biscuits worked. I like the two textures. Mm -hmm. I think the ones at the bottom here can be cooked a little bit more. Yeah. So it's a bit more crunchier. Yeah. So, even though he agrees it's not perfect, Danny's pleased with it. How does the dessert fit the competition criteria, though? For British modern dessert, I don't really think it is. Uh, the elements of it, but I just don't think it's... Um, the impact of it is good enough for me. But is it good enough for his rival? Modern in the fact that it's light and also very representative of where I come from. And I, it's something that's close to my heart. Free barbers past them. I grow my own, so I'm a big rhubarb fan. Yeah, I do. I'm a big fan of rhubarb. So has the dish got enough oomph to get it to the gherkin? If I was one of the judges, it wouldn't tickle my fancy as a great representation of modern British food. Well, we'll find out what they think tomorrow. But how does Danny think it compares with his rival's dessert? It mightn't have all the drama that Noel has, but I believe it eats better.